transition period like for you been for like this first couple of games? Just kind of haven't played um, a competitive game in a while because of the rehab. So what are these kind of that's what it's kind of been like? Yeah, no, it's been really good. Uh, right now, just happy to compete with this team. Uh, I couldn't ask for a better group of guys to go to war with. You know, it's been fun. It's been a fun process. But right now, I'm really just trying to find my role on the team, see what I can do best to help my team win. As a as a point guard with so many new players, do you kind of have to take a step back and let other people find themselves, if that makes sense? Or how does that kind of work? Yeah, I think you definitely do. Uh, the point guard is, uh, as a point guard, you got to find how to how to manage all your players, see what they all they do best, see what all, they, all their weaknesses. And so just really taking a step back, learning that, and then seeing how you can use your talents to help your team win. That's a pretty certain uh, role of a point guard. You've always been a good scorer too. You have to balance that, being aggressive, looking looking for your shot, and and also getting the, the offense flowing. Yeah, yes, sir. Like I said, uh, I'm still just trying to find my role on the team, and uh, it's been great. Uh, I think we've showed a lot of the team. Uh, we showed what we can do, and we still have some things that we need to work on, obviously. But I think as the year progresses, we're going to be a lot better. Is the game moving fast for you right now, or is it slowing down? Or? Uh, it's starting to slow down. Uh, it was moving fast just because, you know, first college game. I've never played in front of a crowd like that. It's just a lot of stuff going back and forth in your mind, but it's starting to slow down for me now. What are those emotions like when you're playing in that environment for the first time? Uh, it's all good emotions, I can tell you that. Uh, having a crowd rooting for you, especially that many people, uh, I mean, it's amazing. I know we're kind of mental in the offseason. You talked about kind of that mental piece and mental block kind of getting over your rehab. Now that you're kind of playing again, how do you feel like you are with that and kind of in that process? Yeah, that mental block is gone completely now. Uh, I've completely let it go. Um, I don't even think about my knee anymore. So it's been, it's been good. So. What are some things you can do, practice court, film room, to find that role? Or is it just about being in games and getting reps? Yeah, uh, film is definitely a big part. Uh, just going in with the coaches and watching players' tendencies and then, like you said, just playing, just continuing to build chemistry on the court. Because our chemistry off the court is like, we're all, we're all brothers. Like, there's no egos, there's no cliques, there's no groups. Like, we're all all one. So that's the best part. Like, Terrence kind of talked about organizing retreats and stuff for you guys. How does that kind of contribute to that off court chemistry? You know, one thing Terrence talked about for the was kind of organized, like organizing meetings together with you guys. Oh, uh, yeah. We kind of did that. How has that kind of contributed to that chemistry? That was good. Um, TJ, that was TJ's idea to like meet a few Sundays during the during the summer and during the fall. And uh, the first meeting, we were just talking about like our goals as a team, and then we talked about our goals personally. And then the second meeting, we just grabbed every player, and then you had like five minutes to talk and just really learn about each other. So it was good. It was it was a smart move by TJ. One thing Brad really liked is your defensive rebounding. Is that something you've always done, or has that been an emphasis of what they're trying to get out of you? Yeah, no, nah, that's definitely been an emphasis. Um, Coach Brad, Coach Tim, Coach Fred, they always tell me, as a guard, usually the point guard gets back on offense. So the defensive rebounds for you are there. So you just got to go chase them. And so that's something I've been focusing on. One thing Brad kind of talked about him being impressed with was kind of the turnovers from the first game to the second game. Was that just kind of the game slowing down for you? I guess what kind of contributed to that? Yeah, definitely the, the game slowing down for me. The first home game, uh, there was just a lot moving there's a lot of a lot of fast pace mind going but second game everything starts to slow down with the coach underwood you don't play if you don't defend right has that been an adjustment for you too oh yeah i've always loved to play defense but college you got to play defense a whole lot harder than high school so it's never been an adjustment but i've been making a lot of progress seems like you and uh, jade nips had good chemistry when you were in there together at the same mm -hmm. time uh, did you feel that and how do you guys complement each other? Yeah, nah, the thing about me and Jada is we, we both like like this off the court. So on the court, there's no egos. We both know what we can do. We both know what we can provide, uh, provide for the team. Jaden, he's an amazing scorer. Uh, a lot of you know from high school. And even he showed it last game, like he can really get to the basket. That one play where he took it all the way down and the little cross over for the layup, that was like, that's Jaden never right there. So the playing with him has been amazing. And I think our, our chemistry is going to continue to grow over the year. Of course, Dan Danger's breakout first two games was a big, yeah. big story. Uh, what's yeah. that do for the guards when you got a you got a guy in there in the paint taking up space and getting offensive rebounds? Uh, having a guy like Dane makes our job a whole lot easier, I can tell you that. Uh, he's just a, a beast down there. And he's been – I think Coach Shea is leading the nation at rebounding. 
Uh, he's been super dominant in the paint. I think he's shooting 90 something percent from field goal. So having someone like Dane is, is amazing. It makes your job a whole lot easier. Thanks, man. Thank you. Thanks, girl.